Hey everyone, it's Beck here. I have got a really awesome little DIY recipe to share with you guys today. I am making up what I call a wet wipe shower. So sometimes when we go off camping, we stay in really, really beautiful places and they don't often have a shower, okay, or a toilet or, or anything like that. So what I like to do is quickly make up this little recipe before we go so that at the end of the day we can just use our wipes to you know have a little bit of a wet wipe shower I can wipe the kids feet over before they jump into their swags at night time and we all go to bed feeling nice and fresh and clean okay when you're camping you need to feel nice and fresh and clean when you jump into your sleeping bag so this is a very, very simple recipe. It's similar to uh, like our cleaning wipes or our baby wipes. It's just a portable version of it, okay? So what I've got here is some paper towel. I've got probably about 20 sheets of our Viva paper towel, okay? And I've already pre, you know, ripped them off the roll so they're individual squares. And then I've just got a Ziploc bag here, okay? So I'm going to pop those, hopefully my bag's big enough. I'm going to put those into the bag and then make up my liquid mixture, okay? So in my jug, that's a perfect fit actually, yay. So in my jug here, I've got about a third of a cup of filtered water and then I'm going to put into there some Castile soap. This is just like another little bit of a natural cleansing agent. Don't want too much, I don't want them to be too soapy. So probably about a teaspoon of Castile soap, just a little bit. Um, and then I'm going to add some beautiful oils. Now I've picked lavender and tea tree, but you could add, you know, your favorite oils that you like for your skin or for, you know, cleansing. Lavender and tea tree are perfect. Um, they've got beautiful, beautiful properties uh, for supporting healthy skin and for cleansing the skin. Smell really good together too. So for that, that many wipes, I'll probably do, I'll do five drops of each, okay? So five drops of tea tree and five drops of lavender. And then what I'm going to add is just a little bit of fractionated coconut oil. Again, maybe a teaspoonful. So I'll just do a few pumps of my bottle here. And that's just going to add a nice little uh, moisturizing element to the skin. I'll just grab a spoon, stir that up, and then what we're going to do is pour that mixture into the bag, down through the wipes, and you want them to be wet, but not soaking. So I'll just see how this feels. Feels pretty good. Um, if you're thinking that it's a little bit too dry, you could always just make up some more of that mixture, some of your water, Castile soap, fraction of coconut oil and essential oils. But that actually feels pretty good to me. So yeah, and then at the end of the day, um, you know, if there's no shower available while you're camping, um, you can just grab out a couple of these, give yourself a nice wipe over and um, you'll feel nice and fresh before going to bed. You could even make these up to put um, like in a little container in your car. If you're trying to sort of move away from store-bought products, um, that's the, they make brilliant wet wipes, you know, for kids' sticky hands, for wiping over high chairs, for, um, you know, anything, wherever you'd use a wet wipe, basically. So yeah. Scents to make, very, very simple, very, very, you know, natural ingredients, water, castile soap, essential oils and coconut oil, that's literally it. And you've got yourself um, some beautiful cleansing wipes that you can use on your body, you can use on your hands, um, wherever you need to. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that recipe. A little camping hack there. Um, yeah, let me know if you give it a go. Thanks for watching, see you later.